Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigam. Today in this video, we have another very interesting and challenging question from algebra, which we are going to solve. So let's get started by writing x cannot be equal to half and 3 over 2. Denominators cannot be 0. Now we will consider this required expression equal to e. Then we will begin with the given quadratic equation 4x square minus 8x plus 1 equal to 0. Now I will add 2 to both sides. So I will write here plus 2. This side also we will write plus 2. Now LHS will become 4x square minus 8x plus 3 equal to 2. Now 4 times 3 is 12 and 6 plus 2 is 8. So we can think about factorization of LHS. 4x square minus 8x we can write minus 2x minus 6x. Then we have plus 3. RHS is 2. Now from first two terms we can take 2x common. So 2x is common in the bracket we will write 2x minus 1. And from last two terms if I will take minus 3 common. So in the bracket I can write 2x minus 1 equal to 2. Now 2x minus 1 is overall common. We will write 2x minus 1 times 2x minus 3 equal to 2. So from here we are getting one very very important result 2x minus 3 this is equal to 2 over 2x minus 1 once we will divide both sides by 2x minus 1. Now if you will see our first bracket of the required expression here we can write 2x minus 3. So I can write this required expression equal to 2x minus 3 whole power 5 minus 2 over 2x minus 3 whole power 5. This is our required expression now. Now I will begin with this box equation. So I can write 2x minus 3 equal to 2 over 2x minus 1. Again I will use one manipulation step or we can use this equation 2x minus 1 equal to 2 over 2x minus 3. Now I can write LHS as 2x minus 3. Then I need to add 2 equal to 2 over 2x minus 3. Or I can take 2 to the RHS and 2 over 2x minus 3 to the LHS. So we can write 2x minus 3 minus 2 over 2x minus 3 equal to negative 2. Now we can assume 2x minus 3. Suppose this is equal to a. So our equation will become a minus 2 over a equal to minus 2. And if I will write our required expression also. Let me write this equation here. a minus 2 over a equal to minus 2. And if I will write our required expression E, which is here, but in this place we will write 2x minus 3. So I can write in terms of a, a power 5 minus 2 over a power whole power 5. This is what we have to evaluate. So I can consider, let's say 2 over a is b. So our first equation will be a minus b equal to minus 2. 
and second equation for our required expression i will write a power 5 i will write as it is minus 2 over a is b so i can write b power 5 this is we have to evaluate and i can write from this equation ab is 2 now calculation and his steps would be easier now i can find out a minus b whole a square both sides from there i can calculate the value of a square plus b square so i can write here a square plus b square minus 2ab equal to minus 2 square is 4 now ab is 2 so i can write a square plus b square minus 2 times 2 equal to 4 or I can write the value of a square plus b square will be 4 plus 4 which is 8. Let me write here a square plus b square equal to 8. Now I will consider cubing both sides. So I will write a minus b whole cube equal to minus 2 whole cube. So I can write a cube minus b cube minus 3ab times a minus b equal to minus 2 cube is minus 8. Now we can calculate a cube minus b cube from this equation as we know ab is 2 and a minus b is minus 2 right hand side is minus 8 or i can write a cube minus b cube plus 12 equal to negative 8 now we'll subtract 12 from both the sides to get the value of a cube minus b cube will be minus 8 minus 12 so i can write minus 20. now we are going to multiply these two equations let's say this is 1 and let us say this is our second equation. So I will multiply both the equations and I can write here a square plus b square times a cube minus b cube equal to 8 times minus 20. Let's multiply term by term a square times a cube a power 5 b square times minus b cube minus b power 5 which is our required expression then we have cross product a cube b square minus a square b cube from there we will take a square b square common out so in the bracket i can write a minus b right hand side will give us minus 160 now this is our required expression e here we will write 2 whole a square and a minus b was minus 2. So I can write here e plus 4 times minus 2 equal to minus 160. e plus 4 times minus 2 equal to minus 160. So we can write e minus 8 this will be equal to minus 160 now we will add 8 to both sides to get our final answer minus 160 plus 8 which will give us our answer minus 152 i hope friends you will like this matter do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.